Hey everybody, Rick Needham handicapping harness racing from Harris Chester Race Course in Chester, Pennsylvania. It's Sunday afternoon, October the 17th, and this is my harnesslink.com, dayatthetrack.com, race of the day. We'll focus on race three. This afternoon, folks, 1.25 p.m. Eastern Post Time. Today we have Pacers racing for a purse of some $10,000. Contenders number four, Trueland Hanover. Number three, Jeffers Party. Number five, Western Avenue. And number six, Hole. A lot of wow. Number four, Trueland Hanover comes off back-to-back-to-back power run wins in his last three starts. Has the advantage of breaking from number four hole this afternoon. This post position here at Harris Chester has afforded starters with a positive 49% wind index in the past six months. I also note this entry has won some $24,400 in the past six months, which is by far the highest earning totals in this field today. Number three, Jeffers Party, a 4 to 1 shot, has hit the board in power run fashion in two of his last three including a power run show finish in his last start in a race which was contested at today's Trackmaster Plus class level of 87. Race 3 summary, number 4, Trueland Hanover, tops my contenders list, which also includes number 3, Jeffers Party, number 5, Western Avenue, and number 6, Whole Lot of Wow, 4, 3, 5, 6, and the third today from Harris Chester. A couple of chest long shots for you to ponder, race 2, <clears throat> Number four, Native Doll, a five to one shot, qualifies as a Trackmaster Plus Power Pony, is at the board in power run fashion in both of her last two outings, including a power run win in her second race back. Race 12, check out the five to one shot. Number four, Mega Lightning, a Trackmaster Plus Power Pony qualifier, comes off back to back power run wins in his last two starts. So from Harris Chester on a Sunday, Rick Needham for HarnessLink.com and DayOfTheTrack.com reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over.